All right, what is going on everybody and welcome. We have Seasons 19, Season of the Seraph. That's the Season 19's title. Trailer. So it is a minute and 43. Let's give it a watch. Time. That looks badass. <laughs> that actually looks so sick. There's a couple of things I want to look through here. Oh my Christ. This is going to be... Right. I love the Rasputin slash like, Seraph weapons. They're super, super cool. Uh, Alright, let's go slowly through this. So, where was that? So first off... This is the EDZ, right? Are we getting a new, like... This is going to be the new seasonal activity where Rasputin's going to, like, charge us with power. So it's going to be like an Escalation Protocol event, I'm going to guess. But... This is going to be cool. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> it looks goddamn awesome. <laughs> I see where he's charging up. So we've got, like, a little... Ooh... I wonder if these are going to be like, so each week, potentially we might have different areas, so basically, I believe this season we're rebuilding Rasputin, right, by the sounds of things. So maybe each week we're going to have like, because Rasputin was on basically every planet, right, so maybe if we're going to even see him on Mars again, like the original, in the original Destiny 1, which would be pretty sick, so take us back to Mars. Now these beams are quite interesting. So they seem to actually buff us in some way. So we see how we move out. That is definitely like it's gonna be like a the buff of Rasputin or something that's gonna just empower us. I'd probably give us crazy soup. That is such an epic shot. <laughs> they so, they do so good with the with the trailers. It's great. And I love Warmind armor. It looks so sick. This thing looks awesome. The weapons look so sick. I'm believing this. This is a new glaive. I wonder if it's new exotic glaive, which would be quite interesting. It looks like if we go to see if we can get a shot of it there. So it sort of looks like it's hive design, which is quite interesting. It's definitely solar. It's got like flames coming off of it and stuff, but it's looking like it's like a hive design. So it could be quite interesting. So another theory that's just coming to me, Ed. So. They're on about the war mines falling into the wrong hands. Maybe this is the hive. Obviously, it looks like they've taken over the area. And they've started to create new weapons, which we're then, you know, we are going to be able to use. Because that's just how we do. This looks badass. It looks like it's sort of holding the hunter in the sky a little bit. Which is interesting. Because if you look, if we slow this down... Let's see, playback speed, point 0.5. So it's sort of, you see it's not going down. It looks like it's holding us in the sky, which is very interesting. 
So could that potentially be an exotic? I think we get two exotics per season, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. We normally get one from the season pass, and then we normally just, just get one. But... That looks very interesting. Now this is Deepstone Crypt that's been um, brought back. This, this thing. Wait, that's Scorn. Is this going to be? This is going to be the dungeon then, right? This thing looks awesome. If we go back, that reload animation is sick. Wait, is that changing sights actually? Hold up. We got one. Nah. Okay, that could be pretty sick. Okay, so we have like a reflex sight going into like an ACOG. Okay. Okay. I like the look of that. That's not the new glaive. What is this? Ah, this is that's, is that the Assassin's Creed arms like ornaments? It is. Yeah, that's the like the Altair armor ornament. Okay, that's gonna be pretty sick. I can't wait for this season. <laughs> and then here, this is looking like we're putting Rasputin into an Exo body. It's looking like um, Clovis, the the Clovis Bray, the. Dude on Europa. Well, robot. <laughs> robot man. The EXO. So this is the... I'm guessing going to be Titans um, ornament first. The Assassin's Creed crossover. If you didn't know, yeah, they're doing a partnership with Ubisoft like they did with uh, Epic Games for Fortnite. But this, this thing just... Oh. I hope that's not an exotic and that's just like... A new way they're going to do legendaries. So you know I have the two barrel types. What is that? That was some sort of hammer. Let me just slow that down. What is that? That's like some mallet. And it's not the super. That's like a piece of... That's going to be like the scythe, I guess. It's going to be the... The weapon for this season. I guess like the scythe was in the haunted. That looks pretty cool. Okay. Alright, I'm super hyped for this season. It's in two hours. <laughs> the armor looks sick. The guns look amazing. Now, I'm hoping that that is not an exotic and it is just going to be across all the Seraph weapons where you can just change sights or something. But, oh, <laughs> I cannot wait to get my hands on those weapons. Obviously, they're going to be craftable as well, so that makes it even better. Well, I hope they're going to be craftable. Seasonal weapons normally are. But these weapons are definitely going to be very, very sought after by me. I, this looks pretty epic. Now, that is a that is an epic shot right there. <laughs> that looks cool. But we're going to leave it there. Um, I'm going to be streaming this later. You're going to see a weekly reset video going up as well. Um, but I will be streaming this later and having a look at everything. So if you're interested, then make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Drop a like if you're super hyped for Season of the Seraph, Season 19. I'll also be checking out Comp as well this week. So, get strapped in for a hell of a lot of Destiny content, because there's going to be a hell of a lot of stuff that's to cover this week. So, yeah, make sure you're subscribed, and I'll see you guys in the weekly reset video and the stream later on tonight. Bye for now.